Hi, I'm Kevin with the firm Public Relations and Marketing. Welcome to the Virtual PR Water Cooler. Today we're demonstrating three tips on taking good headshots of your clients and staff. Just as in writing, you want your pictures to clearly communicate your messages. After all, we're dealing with a thousand words per photograph, even headshots, and you don't want your client CEO appearing in print looking like this. Obviously, the best strategy for excellent headshots is to hire a professional photographer. But if that's not an option, and you have access to a digital camera, try these tips. Avoid the mug shot. Instead of positioning your client or coworker against a wall to say cheese, position the person perpendicular to you and ask him or her to turn at the waist to face you. This three-quarter profile shot is more engaging than a mug shot. Use as much natural light as possible. Taking a photo outside in the shade will look better than the indoor lighting every time. You can also take a photo indoors using a large window to supply the light. But avoid taking pictures with a window behind your subject. It will darken his or her face. You as the photographer should stand with the window at your back while your colleague stands a few feet in front of you. Use a clean background. If you're taking photographs outside, be wary of positioning your client in front of a tree or a bush. Objects that appear to push through the body can detract from your photograph. If you're inside, make sure that you have a wall that's free of framed artwork, pictures, or unusual colors. They can be distracting too. So to recap, use a three-quarter pose, use natural light, and use a clean background. Oh, and remember to take more than three pictures. It'll increase your chances of having a good photograph. I'm Kevin Dunnigan with the firm Public Relations and Marketing. Thanks for joining us at the virtual PR water cooler. Say cheese.